Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Daisy. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make business cards with Cricut Design Space. And to make these business cards, we're going to need cardstock paper for printing. It can be in any color, with texture, designs, or even with glitter. And we're going to start with the process. We're going to insert a square we're going to press the lock and we're going to change the dimensions. And the dimensions for the business cards are three and a half by two. I'm going to duplicate the rectangle several times because I would like to show you how to add background to the business cards before we start putting all the details. The first one is going to be plain white because I would like to add some flower designs, watermark flowers. On the second one, I'm going to add pattern. And to do that, we go to fill, we select print, then we go to the color square over here, and we select pattern. And here, we're going to find all the patterns that are available in Cricut Design Space. We're going to scroll all the way down to find the right one that we need. I'm going to pick this one. You can always edit the pattern. Just go here again to fill. Select the color or the pattern. We go here, edit pattern. And we're going to see here is 100%. We can make it bigger or we can make it smaller. The only thing is that when we make it smaller, it repeats. You can see the repetition of the pattern. If you don't like these patterns, you can always add your own. Either you buy them on Etsy or on any other uh, online stores, or you can find some free ones on Google or Pinterest. On the third one, I'm going to add some flower pattern. I'm going to edit this pattern to make the flowers a little bigger. The background on the last one also gonna be white going to start adding the flower designs. Let's go to upload. I have already uploaded some images, watermark flowers. Um, I'm going to start this one. I found this design on Pinterest and I liked it. It also has the shape of a business card so it will be easy for me to insert this one. I just need to rotate it to 90 degrees and place it on the business card. I also have to make sure that it's three and a half by two. Then I'm going to select both layers and flatten. Now let's go back to the last one and we're going to insert another flower design. I'm going to add a little one on this one so I have more room for the details. Now I'm going to select both layers and flatten. I already showed you how to add background and designs to the business cards. Next, I'm going to show you how to add the details, like the name, a brief description, and the contact information. I'm going to pick a nice font, a beautiful font for the name. Once we have the name with the font that we like, we can change color. Now we're going to add a little descriptions of the services or products that we're offering. And at last, we're going to add all the contact information like telephone numbers, email, web page, Facebook, or Instagram. When we have all the details in place, we select all these layers and press flatten. And here we have the first business card. As you can see, it's very easy to design. Later, I'm going to show you how to cut this business card so we don't waste paper or cardstock. 
Now I'm going to show you another design of how to make a business card. This business card is going to have a picture. I'm going to show you how to insert a picture. We go to upload. I already have a picture uploaded over here. We just select and insert. I'm going to insert a flowers from Cricut Design Space Access. If you don't have the access, you can just filter free and you're going to have all the images that Cricut Design Space have for free. I'm going to ungroup this flower and erase all the layers that I'm not going to need. I'm going to need the circle, place it on top of the picture and I'm just going to slice the face. Remove the layers that I'm not going to need and just leave the picture and resize it so it can fit in the business card. Now that we have the picture, we can go ahead and add all the information for the business card like we did before with the first one. And don't forget to select all the layers and flatten. Here are some of the ideas of how to design business cards with Cricut Design Space. When I send them to print and cut, Cricut only arranged me four on each page. But I'm going to show you so you can print at least two more. Like that, we're not going to waste cardstock. Now that we already have arranged the six business cards together, we're going to select all the layers and press flatten. And we're going to go ahead and print it and then cut. Continue, send to print. And if we have our own printer, we select that printer to print at home. But if we don't, don't worry. We can always save it to PDF and send it to print somewhere else and then come back and cut it at home. I take the bleed off of the business cards but if you wish to leave it on it's up to you. While it's printing we can select the material that we're going to cut. Let's make sure the cardstock that we're going to cut is aligned on the cutting mat. And here we have the business cards designed with Cricut Design Space. Now you already know how to design your own business cards. I hope you have enjoyed my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your visit and I'll see you in my next tutorial.